What is up Division 2 agents? This is Gamer for Life back with another Division 2 video. So you can see I am on my lower shade level character. And the one thing about this character we'll go ahead and see is with my library I am needing a lot of stuff maxed out like with my attributes. A lot of either don't have any or you know the ones that I do have I don't have very many maxed out ones. Right so the beautiful thing about this vendor, the new vendor that we have, you can see how much I don't have. I have a few maxed out things, but not a lot. If you saw my recent video going over the vendor, you did see that all of the proficiency caches and the named item caches were completely god road. And hopefully that's, you know, how they're going to keep it. But you can see we can buy five of the field proficiency in two named items and this is going to definitely help us with our library getting some max rolls as we know we need those max rolls now because we cannot optimize anything past the value of the attributes we have in our library now first i'll go ahead and show you if you're wondering how do you get textiles well if you look here in the caches and the standard apparel cache this is the one that is always there. You're always getting keys for this. So you saw I'm only shade level 125, but I do have 3,300 textiles. And that's because they don't just give you items that you don't have. So it's all random what you get. So a lot of things that I get, even though you can see I, I only have 26 of the 71 items in this cache and I still have 34 keys. And the way you get the keys is just by playing the game. I believe it's every four levels you will get a key. And you can see if I get a duplicate to show you it gives me textiles for that duplicate so this one is not a duplicate that's cool all right here's a duplicate that we have so if you've already have it that they will give us textiles so that's how you get the textiles and then you can come and spend them here every single week uh, he does open just like Cassie. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy all of these because I need all of them on this character anyway or on this uh, account. All right, and we'll go ahead and open those up. We don't need the exotic right now, but let's go ahead and just open these real fast and then we'll look at them after I open them. This name item. Okay, oh, lefty. I'm probably gonna keep that. <laughs> and the lefty, which I'm probably going to keep. So you can see it's all completely maxed out. And I'm really hoping that's intended. Well, that's very nice. So with our, we'll just go ahead and do this one. So this is a rifle. And we definitely, well, I don't know why I equipped it. Why did I equip it? <laughs> I don't need to equip it. Okay. Since we don't have to go back to the White House, we will go to the Tinkering Station and go to Library. Rifles. Attributes. Damage the target out of cover. We definitely want that. So that's what we will put in our library. Perfect. So now we have a max damage to target out of cover in our rifle library. So we can put that on any rifle we have now. All right, we can take a look at some of gear pieces. That's not one of them. I did do some, some, uh, there we are, farming before I did this. Okay. That's all right. We've already got max values of all of those, so that's cool. Okay, here's one. We can do that crit chance for sure. Here's that crit chance. Definitely want that crit chance to be maxed out. Cool. 
so I'm not gonna go through everything and do that I just wanted to show you that this is a beautiful way especially for lower shay level agents like this account here where, where I am only shay level 125 a beautiful way for us to get some max attributes in our library all right my friends hope that helped anyone else that's gonna do it for this video hope you guys are doing good staying safe out there and as always my youtube family take it easy